Hello and welcome to this video. Where are we going to take you on a walk? We do a lot of walking here in DC because it's really set up for walking trails. And in this video we're going to walk from Roslyn through Georgetown, past the Kennedy Centre, over Memorial Bridge and back here to Roslyn. So tell us in the comments the difference between a walk and a stroll. If you're going for a stroll, it means a leisurely pace looking around at things. But Abigail's got one speed. <laughs> and I enjoy that speed. But before we start the walk, there's a brand new place that opened up on our way here in Roslyn. And so now we've got to go check it out first. Look what we've got. We can't go far without coffee, can we? <laughs> we haven't even started our walk. It's a very nice um, location, huh? Absolutely. It's big as well. And uh, okay. for their first weekend. So how's the coffee? Mm, very good. We do this about once or twice a week. And this is such a nice place you want to come sit and draw in. Yeah, it's um, just across the road from the metro stuff that John takes to work. So, over there. Like, just over there. So I could walk with you and then bring my iPad and come and grab a coffee and get a comfy seat and I can sit and draw mm. until you come home. <laughs> That'd be nice. It's going to sit here a long time, apparently. We do like our coffee days, don't we? We like our coffee days, of course. It's a good way to connect. It is. It's a good way to connect. It was great. Now that we're fueled up, we can go on our walk. Yeah, we can. But I must say, uh, it's not its not too cold, but the wind's chilly. Mm. It's this time of year, I suppose. Yep. Not quite spring, but not <laughs> quite winter. <laughs> Scooter and bicycle fishing. Yeah, I wonder what bait they use. This is a little dirt path down by the canal. And we like to come off down here as opposed to up there. We like to get off of M Street as quickly as possible because especially on a weekend. Especially on a weekend. It no. is just chock-a-block heaving. It is the main... Mm. People get dressed up. Yeah. And they come walk in M Street. Yeah. Be seen in Georgetown. Yeah. Look, and which is a nice place. I love Georgetown. Yeah, it's the main commercial area mm. of Georgetown, and so lots of restaurants and bars and boutiques and shops and mm, things. Boutiques. <laughs> yeah. So we like to get off of there as quickly as possible, and this is also a nice um, trail along the canal when it is full. Mm -hmm. They drain it in wintertime. Mm -hmm. During summer, it's full because they have boat, boats going up and down. And also, this is also a good trail because going right. in the opposite direction from us. That's a long nature trail. This oh, yeah. is the C&O Canal, which carries on for literally miles and miles and miles. Mm. So it's a nice nature yeah. trail. And we have taken it for miles and miles and miles. Yeah. And going in the direction that we are going now, you can mm. walk along and get to separate little coffee shops or head to the right where you can get to the waterfront in Georgetown. But now we're going to go walk down the Potomac River. Yeah. Whenever we come down here, we always think this is like New York scenes. Yeah, There's an area in New York along the Hudson River that looks similar to this with this over highway overhang. 
and uh, this is DC's version of that. Much quieter though. <laughs> Everything yes. in DC is much quieter compared to New York. Every time we come back to DC from New York, it's like, calm down. It's a much calmer city. Much calmer. At least the parts that we uh, frequent. Yeah. I'm sure there are obviously parts yeah. to it. But this is a nice park right here on the waterfront. And again, in the summer, it's a lot busier. But it's a lovely area. And there's also, also actually a lovely walk that we can get to from Roslyn on uh, Roosevelt Island. Yeah. And that's Roslyn where we've just come from. All the way in Virginia. <laughs> yeah. And also again, like comparing to New York, this is like <laughs> the view <laughs> over the Hudson of Manhattan. Yeah. That's a DC's version. Smaller version. It's a smaller scale and quieter. Much quieter. So we love to come and do these walks because uh, it's really a form of relaxation, isn't it? And exercise. Depending on whether we stroll <laughs> or whether we speed. walk capital speed. Exercise versus uh, relaxation. Well, it's a good combination of both, either mm. way. DC is really um, set up for walking and mm. running and cycling. They've got so many trails all over there. It's a huge trail network. Mm. And the one thing about walking even through the streets of DC proper, I mean, there's old historical buildings and buildings of federal importance. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to catch you these roller skates, baby. Mm. That over there is the Kennedy Center. Yeah, that is one of our favorite spots in DC, isn't it? It's lovely. And this behind you is the uh, Watergate Hotel. Made famous by President Nixon. Yep. He made them for us at least. I'm trying to walk upright. So I've got a bit of back spasm. So much for walks being good for you. Mm -hmm. So much for walks being good for you. <laughs> now we have to hope he makes it home. Yeah. And we still have a long way to go. We have to cross that bridge, Memorial Bridge. Not this bridge, the second bridge. These are the Watergate steps, and as you can see, very popular with the uh, mm, fitness today. people. It's usually a lot of people running up and down. And also they do their exercise meetups here, right in front of Lincoln Memorial. This is always a, a very long but very significant milestone on our walk back home. Memorial Bridge leads up to Arlington Cemetery. And it's always very busy. Arlington National Cemetery. This is the part of the walk we like least. Oh, I don't like this bit. <laughs> we just got to get this part over. Let's just say that it's not because of the cemetery that we don't like this, but it's like 
because we ride on the highway. How's that feel for you, baby? <laughs> this is where it starts and it doesn't stop until we get home. Oh, yeah. <laughs> How far was it again? It's approximately four and a half miles long mm. and has taken us about two hours to walk, so a leisurely stroll. Did that include the coffee time? It did include our coffee stop. It doesn't really matter what time of year it is that you come do this, of course. This is cold and the wind is cold, but that helps. Yeah. Helps the walk, it's never that cold. Summer, different story. Very different story. But you dress appropriately and you accept the fact that you're going to sweat. Yes. Fortunately though, it is a pretty easy walk. It's fairly flat the whole way, except for this last bit. It starts down by the highway of Arlington Cemetery and then doesn't stop until we are home. And it's walking trails the whole way. So the end of this walk is in the Iwo Jima Park. The memorial over there. My favourite part of the walk is uh, yeah, the section. We in, share the same favourite spot, don't we? Yeah, it's the, the part in front of the Kennedy Centre. Yeah. Well, all the way up then to Roslyn, uh, to uh, Georgetown. Georgetown. What you have to do is tell us about your favourite uh, walk in your, in your part of the world. Or if you're here in DC. Yeah, tell us about that one. What walks do you enjoy? Let us know. And uh, I hope you enjoyed coming along with us on this walk. You have to subscribe. All you have to do, you take your finger, you go down and you tap on the subscribe button. All it takes. And then hit the bell to be notified when we share another walking video. Okay. See you in the next one.